All right, guys, here we are at 141 Moonstone Court in Sterling Farms. Little, uh, neighborhood. Very highly desired neighborhood right here in Sterling Farms, um, just for the fact that um, it's just outside of city limits, so you don't have to pay city taxes, just county taxes. Um, but most of the time here, you are on um, septic. But I think that... Um, Are you on septic out here? I think that you're actually here on um, your community sewer here, so um, it's one one of the only places where you actually can buy outside the city limits and not be on septic. Um, anyway, walk in the house. I love these floors. Um, I'm actually putting um, these same exact floors in my house. Um, gas log fireplace. All right, give you a little panoramic. There's the front window for your living room here, front door. Okay, this is your dining room. Then you walk into your kitchen here. So this is not really um, open floor. Um, it's kind of, it's actually kind of set up like um, my listing at 404 Commons. Go out the back door here. You have a stamped patio. Um, it's probably about a 10 foot by 10 foot patio um, with a nice size backyard completely fenced in. Okay. Um, the AC unit probably looks like it's probably the original unit from the house. Um, I'm not exactly sure what this is right here. Let's take a look. It looks like your water shut off. It looks like there's a broken pipe in there that fixed. All right, I'm starting to rain out here. All right. But there is no covering for the patio uh, for the patio or nothing. It's just uh no. all right, now it's starting to rain. All right. So the screen is actually loose in that door. Big fixes. All right. So back into the kitchen. Um, now these doors right here, I thought was going to be a pantry. It is not. It is your washer and dryer hookup, which is here in the kitchen. Okay. All stainless steel appliances. I love the cabinetry. It matches the floors. All right. But no, these do not have granite countertops. There's very little countertop space in here. All right. That's all you got. Uh, a little bit of cabinet space. Um, and you got to do have a small pantry right here, though. All right. All right. So we're going to walk out. Um, this is actually um, a guest bath here. Your half bath. Downstairs half bathroom. Uh, remember, that's your living room. Bathroom. This is going to be a closet. Like a coat closet, but it's underneath the stairwell, so it's got the slanted uh, roof. And this door right here goes to your garage. All right, two car garage. That is a brand new hot water tank. Okay, I don't have any. I don't have an information sheet with me because I was out showing houses, and you said you wanted to see this house, so I just um, swung over here so we can take this video real quick. All right, so we're gonna go upstairs real quick. All right, now, um, carpet is not new, still worn, um, but still in pretty good shape. All right, so you get to the top of the steps. If you take a right, this is actually the bonus room, which is very, very big, okay? You have a closet right here. It's not a, it's not a walk in closet. But it's a closet. Okay. Have a big window right there, which is nice. I like that window. Now these right here, um, I've seen these in, in homes before, but most of the time there's a door here, and that you got a little bit of like a, a storage place here. There's another one right here on this wall, um, but they're actually just framed up right now, so there's no door, there's no nothing. It's just um, that right there. Okay. So if you go down the hallway, the first door on the left is going to be the guest bath and shower, full shower, full bathroom, okay? 
Which I don't, I don't see any. I don't know upstairs. I don't see any um, water stains on ceilings or anything. All right, second door on the left is your master bedroom. All right. It's a nice size room. Um, I would say it's probably uh, 15 by 12 maybe. All right, then over here is your walk-in closet, which is a nice size closet, all right. All right, and then over here is going to be your master bathroom. So you do have a stand-up shower. You have your soaking tub with the window. And you have your double sink vanity. That's kind of on a corner. All right. And then, uh, you know, of course you got your toilet. But it's a nice size bathroom. Okay. All right. So, um, if you go, your next door to the left is a spare bedroom, which is kind of small. Um, I'd say it's maybe uh, 10 by 11, um, if that, okay? Next is the other bedroom, which is probably a little bit smaller, um, 9 by 10 maybe, okay? And then you'll have a linen closet right here. All right, and then you have this like area right here um, where all the rooms kind of connect um, up here. So you do have a little bit of room up here. Um, but anyway, all right, so there is your um, three bedrooms. You have the bonus room, which can be counted as a bedroom. Um, so it's four bedrooms, looks like two and a half bathrooms. I'll find out the square footage and the year built and things like that for you. Um, but the outside of the house looks good, the roof looks good, like I said, the floors look good. Um, it looks like the whole inside of the house has been painted. Fixtures look good. Um, you have these nice blinds on all the windows, fully fenced in backyard, in a highly desired neighborhood. Um, all right, so this is 141 Moonstone Court. And we'll head over to, uh, head over to the other home that you guys are interested in and uh, take the video, and I'll talk to you guys soon. All right, bye.